Voilà, en attendant la troisième course, en attendant que le cheveu se prépare pour cette troisième course, nous allons parler à John Clett qui s'est occupé de nos apprentis pendant deux semaines. Et euh, il va nous parler euh, de ce qu'il a vécu avec euh, nos apprentis. So John, you've been working uh, with our apprentices for about two weeks. Yes, it's been very good. Uh, uh, we had a very good uh, reception um, with all of them. They, uh, they want to learn and hopefully going forward we would uh, expand on, on, on the apprentice school here. So what have you been doing exactly? Been watching a lot of race films with the riders who are riding in races. Um, been doing a lot of mechanical horse. Uh, have been watching a lot of the uh, local boys in uh, Florial, helping them with their techniques um, uh, and so on, and mechanical horse and everything. And you've been doing the same thing in South Africa. Where do you work exactly? Could we know about it? In Australia, yes. Um, look, I've been doing the job for four years. Um, I pass all my assessments and a fully fledged uh, riding coach um, and I have 30 years of experience riding in races as well so um, I'm very experienced. So from the apprentices who have been following your course given during these two weeks is there anyone coming out from the lot? Oh, look I think they all have sh they show a lot of a, lo a lot of ability and um, and very good talent it's just about improving and making them better and teaching them the, the safety aspects of a very dangerous job and uh, keeping them healthy and uh, making everything go well going forward. John, thank you very much. I guess that you're coming back in February. Yes, we're coming back in February to, keep, to make sure everything is going well. Thank you very much. Alors, quant à nous, maintenant, nous allons rejoindre nos collègues dans le studio pour l'analyse de cette troisième course où le favori a pour nom Moi et Power de l'écurie Mervin monté par James Swings.